Get ready because the next massive move for Bitcoin and the entire crypto market begins today. As we have two major things happening today, first of all, this very important monthly candle close for the first month of 2024, as well as the FOMC rate announcement later on today. So make sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel because we are calling these market moves before they happen, updating you in advance. I told you when we were bottoming out for Bitcoin, expecting that next big high. I warned everybody the day before the ETF came out, the exact level that we were looking for, a rejection. And of course, in the Casper Crew VIP Discord, these are setups that we have also given in advance. We are giving you guys the juice. Make sure to subscribe, like the video, click that bell for notifications. Let's get right into this. In 10 hours, we are going to close the January 2024 candle. And this is a very, very crucial candle close because if we take a look at the past entire bull bear cycle, if we pull a Fibonacci retracement from the all-time high to that bear market low, you can see that this monthly candle has indeed wicked up and rejected from the 618 Fibonacci level. And the reason why this is so important right now is because if we look historically at what the Bitcoin price has done, when we come to the macro market cycle, golden pocket 618 Fibonacci level, we get a big correction to the downside of at least 40% to retest the support that we formed during the previous bull market. It happened back here in 2016. It happened once again, right here in 2019. Are we seeing the history repeat right now? It's a very important time in the market cycle because the white line on this chart represents the Bitcoin halving, which always sparks the next bull market. So we can see right here, we are very, very close to that halving, which is going to catapult Bitcoin to a new all time high if this cycle continues to repeat, and I do believe it will. However, we cannot ignore the fact that we've seen at least a 40% correction every single market cycle as we come up to this Fibonacci golden pocket level. So we need to be paying attention to this chart. And right now, this is a very, very critical time because the Bitcoin price is once again back inside of this sideways range. And depending on what happens today, in my opinion, will determine whether or not we see this pattern repeat. This is going to be the determining factor as to whether or not we can target a new high or a new low for Bitcoin. Now, the 618 Fibonacci level, as many of you may be aware, is actually a female. Her name is Six Juanita. This is a picture of her right here, a very beautiful girl. And in high school, I had a huge crush on her. I was fantasizing about asking her to be my girlfriend, getting married. We would get matching Ben Coin tattoos and live happily ever after. Turns out, guys, fellas, when I asked her out, she was like, oh, Jason. I like you, but I don't like you like that. I like you like a brother. I thought you I thought you knew. And I was like, <gasps> oh my goodness, look at the rejection that happened right from the 618 to Fibonacci, the purple candle, boom, bear flag, boom, lower, lower, lower. Now, why did she reject me? It was because I was a nice guy and nice guys finished last. And 618 was into bad boys like this guy right here, Sam Bankman Freed. Now look at Sam Bankman Freed's pectoral muscles. All right, would well, you notice anything about them? Very crooked, very uneven. Now the medical term for this is called a bearish divergence. And actually if we take Sam Bankman Freed's nipples and impose them onto the chart right here, we can literally see that as the price is getting to this very key area, Sam Bankman Freed's money flow and momentum nipples are getting lower. This is called a bearish divergence, okay? And this typically leads to a big move to the downside. And after we saw that big move to the downside, notice what we did on the chart here. We actually, for the first time since September 11th, 2023, made a lower low on the daily time frame. Very significant. September 11th, I'm sorry, this is August 17th. August 17th, low, high, higher low, higher high, higher low, higher high, higher low, higher high, higher low, higher high. We have now made a lower low for the first time since August 17th. Now this is called a change of market structure on a high time frame like the daily. And typically this is a sign that we are going to come much lower. However, as we've watched price kind of develop here, the break to the downside has been very weak. This is not really a convincing break to the downside, is it? And when we take a look at some of these higher time frames, such as the four day time frame, things are actually looking quite bullish. When we take a look at the three day time frame, we have confirmed a nice, beautiful green dot with money flow getting thicker here. So this brings us back to our love story. Because after we have asked out Six Juanita and she has rejected on rejected us. We are now thinking to ourselves, you know what? I've been hitting the gym. Maybe I'm a little bit more bad. Maybe I could take off these nerdy glasses and be like, what up 618? I'm a bad boy, right? Because look at this. If we take the Fibonacci retest from that high that we made the first time we asked her out to the low that we made a few days ago, we are coming up once again, gathering the testicular fortitude to ask her out again. 
what is going to happen now this is the key level that we need to be aware of on our charts because this is literally going to determine whether or not i open up a new long trade or a new short trade why is that well this right here if we are going to change market structure and make a lower high and then come down and make a lower low most likely it is going to be from that 45 to 46 thousand dollar level where we have the 618 fibonacci level okay now this is not the macro 618 this is a, a local 618 level this is the hometown 618 okay what does that mean it means we have a chance of actually getting her to say yes to our romantic inquiry because this is a small country town her options are very limited she might have to settle she might have to come down a few notches and settle for your boy jay casper because she might think to herself look if i don't date this guy i'm never going to get married i'm never going to have kids and my life is just going to be horrible and lonely for the rest of my life so there is a chance that when we come up to this level we actually get accepted and then if we get accepted above this level the probabilities are very very high that we are going to make a new high on the bitcoin price okay so what do we need to be aware of first of all if we see a rejection from this level meaning we come up here and we see bearish divergences on some of these lower time frames right we're already starting to see them kind of form here on the one hour we come up here we start to see the momentum waves and the money flow getting lower the upside down sandbag mid read pattern we see that pattern and we clearly see bitcoin rejecting from this level this means i will be looking to open up a new short trade right here and take it down to a new low however if we see that we ask out six Juanita and she's like, you know what, Jason, my options are limited. I'm going to settle for you. We want to see a break of this level, hold this as support with a retest. And then we can actually enter into a long trade from this same exact level around that $45,000, $46,000 level. And we can look to take it up to, in my opinion, a new high of at least uh, $50,000, around a $50,300, give or take. All right. These are the two trades that I am looking to take here. By the way, guys, if you want to trade Bitcoin and altcoins along with us, check out my two go-to exchanges. First of all, this long trade, the setup we gave in advance in the Casper Crew VIP Discord, currently up right now in some juicy profit as well as we have taken lots of profits out along the way. The entire month of January has been dang juicy, guys. I'm trading right now on ZoomX. I'm also trading on an exchange called Mexi. Mexi, the best fees in the game right now. I'm also trading on BingX. All these exchanges, guys, do not require KYC, so you just need a VPN. Links in the pinned comment and the description. Also, if you want to join the Casper Crew VIP Discord, where we give the setups in advance, where we do multiple live streams every single day with our instructors, giving you the levels, giving you the setups, you can go to jasoncaspertrading.com, click the link to join the community, where you will not only find a thriving community, but lots of resources, an entire beginner's course, a channel where you can ask any noob question in the world and have a friendly, nice response. And if you want to fast track your education, learn how to trade, check out the courses we got here, including my scalping course, where I show you how I made 25K in a month scalping low timeframes, White Phoenix's smart money approach to trading, my intro to crypto trading course, which actually includes the scalp course and the order flow course. So you can learn how to get those extra market insights from footprint market profile and TPO. All right, guys, that is it for today's video. Make sure to like, subscribe, click the bell. May God bless all of you in the name of Jesus, Yeshua, the Messiah. Even if you are not religious, I still pray you and your family are very, very blessed. And I will see everybody in the next video. Peace.